What does this sign mean? Maximum speed is 30 kilometers per hour. Motorway continues for 30 kilometers. Parking not allowed for more than 30 minutes. Distance to junction is 30 meters. What does this sign mean? Entrance to horse riding school, race course ahead, riding path, no vehicles allowed, accompanied horses and ponies ahead, What should a driver be aware of when approaching a vehicle which is attempting to park? The driver may have to stop and assist the driver parking the vehicle. That the vehicle being parked may move out without warning. The vehicle may be parking at an area designated for loading. That there may be a driveway at the point where the vehicle is parking. What do these signs together mean? Clear way ahead, no stopping or parking during times shown, access for buses and taxis only during times shown, pedestrianized street ahead, traffic not allowed except during times shown, parking not allowed during times shown. What does this sign mean? Tunnel ends ahead. Dual carriageway ends ahead. End of central reserve or obstruction. Beware of vehicle with a wide load. What should the car driver be aware of in this situation? The road ahead becomes a dual carriageway. The road ahead is for cars and light vehicles only. Road marking is taking place ahead. Animals could suddenly appear on the road ahead. What effect does a worn exhaust have on a vehicle? It causes the water coolant to leak from the engine. It causes oil to leak on the road. It causes noise and gas pollution levels to increase. It increases fuel consumption.
According to the pre-crash report, in how many fatal collisions was alcohol a contributory factor? Four out of ten. Two out of ten. Six out of ten. One out of ten. What should a driver do before getting out of the vehicle? Open the door part way and then look behind. Check the interior mirror before opening the door. Open the door and exit the vehicle without delay. Check their side mirror and look behind before opening the door. What does this hand signal mean? The driver intends to reverse. The driver intends to slow down or stop. The driver intends to turn left. The driver intends to move straight ahead. The bus ahead is moving away from a bus stop. What should a driver do? Try to get past it to avoid being delayed. Signal to the bus driver to let you pass. Slow down and allow it to move out. Drive alongside it because you have right of way. What should a driver do if the right-hand headlight bulb fails when driving at night? Drive with the right-hand indicators on. Replace it temporarily with the left-hand bulb. Replace it temporarily with the brake light bulb. Have the bulb replaced immediately. Is it permitted to use a vehicle in a public place without a current tax disc displayed? Yes, but for not more than one month after the expiry of the previous disc. Yes, but for not more than 10 days after the expiry of the previous disc. No, all motor vehicles must be taxed before the vehicle is taken on the road. No, 
Only vintage vehicles are exempt from displaying a tax disc. What should a driver do when driving in heavy rain? Be on the alert for sliding or aquaplaning. Maintain normal speeds as on a dry road. Weave the vehicle slightly in order to improve tire grip. Increase speed so that the vehicle will glide over any standing water. When should the handbrake be used to bring a vehicle to a halt? Only when going downhill? Never. Only when going uphill? Anytime. While driving, a driver notices a strong smell of fuel. What should they do? Drive at a reduced speed. Stop where safe and investigate. Open the windows and continue on. Turn on the fan to clear the air. What traffic may drive along a cycle lane accompanied by a continuous white line? Cyclists and taxis? Cyclists and motorized wheelchairs? Cyclists and motorcyclists? Buses and cyclists? Why might it be dangerous to drive on a poorly lit street? Pedestrians crossing in a dark area might be difficult to see. Drivers can only see the traffic in front of them. Traffic lights will not be working. Drivers can only see the traffic coming against them. Who is responsible for ensuring that a passenger under 17 years of age is wearing a seatbelt while driving in a car? The driver, but only when the passenger is in the front seat. The passenger only. The passenger's parents. The driver only. A driver has stalled in the middle of an unguarded level crossing and cannot restart the engine. The warning bell is ringing. 
what should the driver do? Walk clear of the crossing and phone the signal operator so that trains can be stopped. Stay at the vehicle and warn the approaching train. Try to restart the engine in first gear. Push the vehicle clear of the crossing. According to the pre-crash report, out of 867 fatal collisions, how many had alcohol as a contributory factor? 101 to 200, 201 to 250, 251 to 350, less than 100. When in a hurry and another vehicle cuts in front, what should a driver do? Flash the headlights to express their annoyance. Drive faster to make up for lost time. Drive closely behind them so other vehicles cannot do the same. Be patient and not retaliate. When driving on a country road without footpaths, what should a driver look out for coming towards them on their side of the road? Tractors, pedestrians, motorcyclists, cyclists. What action should a driver take if the engine in their vehicle cuts out suddenly when they are driving along? Engage a lower gear. Check the handbrake is fully off. Depress the accelerator and then release it. Signal and steer the vehicle to the side of the road. When a driver intends to make a left-hand turn on a busy city street junction and there are pedestrians and cyclists around, what should a driver do? Stay close to the left to prevent cyclists or pedestrians coming up on your left side. Signal left, watch the right-hand mirror and make the turn when it is clear. Sound your horn as you proceed to warn the other road users of your intentions. Watch for cyclists or pedestrians who may try to cross the road in front of your vehicle.
What is the minimum safe distance to leave between vehicles travelling at 100 km per hour on a dry road? 92 metres. 62 metres. 72 metres. 82 metres. What should a driver do when they approach roadworks warning signs? Reduce speed and be prepared to stop for works vehicles or a flagman. Engage a lower gear to improve grip and maintain speed. Maintain speed until signals to slow down by a flagman. Engage a higher gear to avoid getting stuck in soft ground. What is the likely consequence of sudden braking? The vehicle could be hit from behind. The vehicle's braking system could overheat. There will be no consequences as the vehicle's brake lights will come on. The vehicle could be overtaken. On a motorway, when should a driver use the hazard warning lights? When another vehicle is following too closely? When towing another vehicle? When slowing down quickly because of danger ahead? When driving on the hard shoulder? The driver intends to turn right at this junction. What should the driver do? Stop in front of the motorcycle. Stop in front of the bus. Proceed in front of the motorcycle and the bus. Stop at the line. How does the driver know a vehicle's total load carrying capacity? By checking the horsepower of the engine. By referring to the vehicle manufacturer's specification. By counting the number of seats. By measuring the size of the boot.
What should a driver do if the vehicle's windows are covered in ice? Switch on the windscreen wipers. Use boiling water with salt to clear the ice. Switch on the heating system and use a scraper to clear the ice before driving. Drive at a reduced speed until the heating system has cleared the ice. What does this road marking mean? A driver must not cross the broken white line unless it is safe to do so. A driver may not park along this road. A driver may overtake provided they do not cross the broken white line. A driver may not overtake along this road. What should a driver do when entering a tunnel? Switch on hazard warning lights. Switch on full headlights. Switch off the radio. Switch on dipped headlights. What is a clearway? An area that is reserved for pedestrians. An area where stopping and parking is not allowed during certain times. An area where stopping and parking is reserved for buses and taxis. An area that is reserved for cyclists. The driver is approaching traffic lights that they know have been green for some time. What should the driver do? The driver should stop as the lights are about to change to red. The driver should prepare to stop in case the lights change before they reach them. The driver should accelerate to clear the light before they change. The driver should maintain speed until the light changes to amber.
What should the driver allow for when following the bus on an icy road? A shorter braking distance. Same braking distance as in dry conditions. A longer braking distance. Same braking distance as in wet conditions. What specific observations should a driver make before reversing their vehicle? Look in door mirrors only. Look over right hand shoulder. Look in interior mirror only. Look over both shoulders and behind. When is jackknifing most likely to occur? When traveling uphill? When the trailer springs are over greased? When traveling sideways across a slope? When trying to reduce speed sharply while traveling downhill? When meeting oncoming traffic on a national road, is it permitted to move into the hard shoulder to allow following traffic to overtake? No, it is never permitted to drive on a hard shoulder except in the case of an emergency. Yes, when a truck or bus is oncoming. No, except on 2 plus 1 roads. Yes, temporarily when the hard shoulder is clear and it is safe to drive there while the faster traffic overtakes. 